a body falling under gravity covers two points A and B separated by 80 meters in 2 seconds. The distance of upper point A from the starting point is dash meters. Take G value is 10 meter per second square. A body is dropped from certain height. Let us take total height is equals to H. Here two different points A and B. This is the initial point. Body is dropped from this point. Initial velocity is equals to 0 meter per second. The distance between A and B is 80 meters. This body covers these two points from A to B within the time 2 seconds. By using this information we have to find out the distance from starting point to the point A. Let us take this distance is x and take this point is o. O to a distance is equals to x. Take equations of motion. v square minus u square is equals to 2as. v square. Initial velocity of the dropping body is 0. 2 into a is acceleration due to gravity and s is equals to x. Then V is equals to square root of 2G X. So this is the velocity of the body when it reaches to the point A. So at A point this velocity becomes to the initial velocity to reach to the point B. So at A point initial velocity is square root of 2G X. And distance is equals to 80 meters. Time is equals to 2 seconds. Now take the equation s equals to ut plus half a t square. Distance between a to b is 80 meters. Initial velocity at point a is square root of 2 g x. Given time is 2 seconds. Half into g into 2 whole square. Here this body is traveling in downward direction. So all the signs are negative, get cancelled on both sides, that's why take plus sign only. 80 is equals to 2 into square root of 2g x plus 4 into 10 by 2, 2 1s, 2 2s. 2 into square root of 2 into 10, 20, 20x 20 is equals to 80 this plus 20 goes to that side minus 20. 80 minus 20 equals to 60. 2 1s, 2 30s. Now squaring on both sides. 20x is equals to 30 whole square. 30 whole square is equals to 900. 0, 0 get cancelled. 2 1s, 2 45s. x is equals to 45 meters. The distance of separation between these two points from O to A is 45 meters. Here answer is 45.